Hello all, um, welcome to this very quick update from Belfast Worm Farmer. There was a huge storm um, blew across Northern Ireland and England during the night with huge difference in barometric pressure um, which um, will affect your worms if the worms sense a temperature, um, a fluctuation in the barometric pressure. Um, they think there's a storm coming so they will leave the worm bin and go to the surface. We've already checked on our worms and they're all okay so we suggest you do the same. Um, because the huge difference in pressure will make them want to leave the bin because they're worried that the, the rain will come down and flood their, their um, tunnels so they come to the surface they don't drown um, so check your worm bins. Um, during the week we did worm date uh, episode 14 of Belfast Worm Farmer um, and we tried a citrus orange in one of our worm bins which we're just going to check on now um, and then also we're going to have a check on very quickly on some of the avocado that we place in other bins. Um, so far we've had very good results with avocado, so if you have any avocados uneaten, um, worms love them. Just turned over this avocado, and there's actually a worm crawling out of it. It's a really good sign that they that they like avocado. This will be the second lot of avocado we've said fed our worms in recent days, weeks, sorry. We're gonna try the blood orange in, in this bin. If you've never seen a blood orange before, here's one. It has distinctive red marking around the outside. Right, I want you to put it in this side please Harry. Just done that, just leave it. This was the bin that we added the, uh, the blood orange to on Wednesdays, just want to check it out. Um, we added carrot and paper, um, trusty old worm snugs in there, um, really doing well there. Um, dragon fruit, this one's just falling apart to complete mush really now. Um, but there's cocoons um, underneath there and worms, I'll just pick it up and it's all very mushy now. Um, was there anything else in this bin that was... Uh, there's plenty of worms in this bin. Harry, can you get really close down to here? There's six or seven cocoons very close together with some very big worms there. Them? They're just there, there now, aren't they? Yeah. Um, just have a quick rummage around on the top. Yep, so all good there. Um, no avocado in this one if I remember really. But we shake this off and then we'll check. No signs of worms. of worms there at all. Kind of a worry because we can get our hands on quite a few citrus products. Um, yeah, right. Okay, we'll cover that back over and we'll leave it, um, and we'll just check, check on the other bins. So basically, at the moment, it's we with the orange. We're not we're not too sure whether the worms are loving it or not. Um, but Emily, the crazy worm lady, check her out on YouTube. She has had success with feeding citrus to worms. Another avocado. Um, the big fat worm there has actually eaten all of it. Um, the worms have eaten this avocado and just left us the skin, which is like leather. Um, yeah, that's a very good shot there, how big that worm is. It's on its way back inside. In typical Northern Ireland weather, the rain has suddenly come on. We've had storms this morning with torrential rain. We've had sun this afternoon, and now it's raining again. So we're going to wrap up here and yeah, finish up what we're doing. Um, but yeah, thank you for, for the continued support. Like, shares, and comments. But if you do want to see any more of our videos, click up here. And if you want to subscribe, click and read the comments below. Leave, leave the comments below, sorry. Thanks very much. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.